we're going to raise the bed up, we're going to pop some armrests in just to make you comfortable. So if you just lift your arms up a wee bit. So a MAG3 Renogram is a kidney scan and what that's looking for is to assess the drainage of the kidneys. We do MAG3 Renograms in children and in adults. Uh, the doctor refers uh, the patients to us when they're concerned about a blockage in their kidneys. And that's as far in as you're going. Okay. We set up the patient on the, on the scanning bed and actually inject them while they're on the camera. We would inject a radioactive tracer. The radioactive tracer is injected while the patient is on the bed. Uh, we're essentially going to watch and see the radioactive tracer go through the patient to the kidneys and then watch the kidneys as they drain. And what we do is we take a series of pictures over 30 minutes and we stack those pictures all up together and create a video and then do some extra analysis on the images and what we look at is the uptake of the radiopharmaceutical, which is the tracer that we inject, how it goes into the kidneys and then drains into the bladder. A MAG3 renogram takes 30 minutes to acquire. You have to lie very still for those 30 minutes. There'll be medical technologists in the room all the time with you, um, but you do have to lie still for that 30 minutes. And we've got a DVD player for entertainment. You won't get the results on the day, um, what happens is the scan will be acquired by, by the technologists, uh, the scan will be then given to the physics team who will then have a look at the scan, uh, write a report and send that to your doctor and at the next appointment when you're next due to see the doctor, that will then, uh, they will then be able to give you the results then. Right, you can sit up now.